It's just absolutely not going to happen at this pace. Okay, so I'm really excited for this next item because she's never done it before, and this is so cool. I love corduroy. I don't know why. I just think it reminds me fall, winter. I love the texture about it, and so she has created in the famous DG2 design, in the pattern, a first-time corduroy boot-cut jean. I have three colors. We have the sage I have in my hand, we have the navy, and we have the black in petite, average, and tall, and once again, Again, because it's zipped with buttons, we're going to go zero through 24 in this one. So zero through 24. Diane, thank you for doing these. I know you've done corduroy before, but these are brand new tonight. You know, thank you for loving it because I'm absolutely obsessed with corduroy. And where I feel we led before COVID, maybe a dressier life at this time of year fall into. Now I think it's more casual. So what do I love about corduroy? I love that it's pinwheel. I love that it is uh, by its nature in cotton, a matte finish that draws light in. So nothing is shiny. There's no polyester. It is to me, college football game. It's pumpkin picking. Tailgating. It's tailgating. It's, it's everything that you love about fall, winter, and early spring. And I love the fact that it shadows your inner thigh and your outer thigh. I believe Callie is wearing a size 18 here. And it has showed up all over Europe as the number one fabric for casual wear for the season. So if you love, like I do, Rather than mixing a bunch of prints together, not my thing at all, I love mixing texture. Right, right. This is literally velvet that they then put a mechanical rake through and make it stretch velvet becomes stretch corduroy. Yeah. It's more casual. It's more everyday. It's a little more preppy. I love it with yeah. a tweed blazer and a simple DG2 turtleneck. But, oh, my gosh, the price is fantastic. Wait, the Diane, I'm seeing are way over $100. Explain yeah. the stretch on this, because this is new to a whole lot of people. There's a ton of stretch in there. You know, because it is what we call cheap value cotton, cotton in its best form has its own flexibility for the yarn, but we added a lot of spandex. You don't want to overdo the amount of spandex. But I wanted to make sure that if you were going to try a low pile fabric, that it had so much comfort level to it, so much give, that you would fall in love with it instantly. And here's the interesting thing. It is, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to sound like somebody who's doing decorating because I was watching a Martha Stewart show. She's on our sister channel, uh, QVC. And she was talking about, well, get the guys with the snow plows out to your house and tell them you want your entire front lawn plowed just two and a half inches high. <laughs> and I'm thinking, her guys must be a lot more intellectually wow. powerful than mine are. <laughs> but that's what we do <laughs> with corduroy. You tell them. How big do you want it? Mm, pinwheel, I want it delicate. How high do you want really it? Great. Well, I want it dense, but thin, so that it doesn't create any extra bulk, so there's no chafing on the inner thigh. Corduroy is one of those fabrics, you are going to see it in online high-end catalogs. Season after season now, keep gaining in strength. It will be 10 times more relevant by next year because so many people are going to buy into it. Well, wait, Fabulous Diane, fabric. I do have a question. I'm sure a lot of people do because, again, this is new. Um, what? How do you compare that to the classic <laughs> stretch and the virtual stretch? What should we do in size? Oh, I think, it's, I think it's very different, but I would really compare it to the new classic stretch, what we have on. Okay. It, it's just a comfort plus, and the thing I love about it is it gives you a richness, but it gives you more variety of things you can do in it than velvet does. But truly, corduroy starts out 
as velvet, and then you tell them, I want a pinwheel rake through it. No, no, no. I want it to be one inch wide, whatever you want. So we customized it. And then I thought, personally, it was perfect in a boot cut. And it washes like a dream, too. But it is uber comfortable. Well, you know why? Because I wouldn't I make anything that wasn't. I really love the idea you did the boot cut, only because it's a little more tailored. You know, like, for example, if you got the black pair and you wore these to the New Year's Eve party you're going to, perfect. Because, you know, it's that oh, really sweet yeah. spot between being a velvet but not being a velvet. Uh, it's much yeah. more wearable than a traditional velvet would be because it's a corduroy. And there is something wonderful about it. Again, you know, I love the idea of a really great turtleneck and a really great down uh, jacket, a vest down vest. Oh, and, and you looks wear it with great these. with puffer. Oh, yes. yeah. oh a puffer another, jacket. A yeah. Totally other. Um, so let's say you have that with a wide, chunky, ribbed sweater. And then you've got the puffer vest over it. So you've got three different textures going and maybe a suede boot, four different textures going. That to me is modern dressing, yes. but smart dressing and, and smart spending on fashion is when we say to you, you're getting corduroy at the very beginning of what is gonna be a meteoric popularity rise in it. And we all know as things get more popular, they get more expensive too. You will also find there's a lot of stretch in the waistband as well we fit it as our classic jean so you would take really and truly your classic size in this and i think you are going to be overwhelmed at what a gorgeous piece of fabric this is and I want you guys to see, so again, this is a sage. Remember, this is the sweater, the V-deck that's on sale. Look at that if you want to so do a little good. monochromatic. Oh, it looks yeah. so cute. But then look at this. If I grab the gray and you want to take that to the black. I mean, just this is so easy. This is entertainment wear. You know, you're never going to get it before yeah. the holidays. So you can still wear it on New Year's Eve if you have the friends coming over for the first time in a year and a half. And you're all going to be together. It's that perfect entertainment outfit. Put on a really chunky, cool necklace with this. Put on the right little shoe. And you look so pulled together, uh, but not stuffy. Um, you're going to be wildly comfortable because it's her stretch fit. Uh, but again, you've got a really sophisticated look. And this, I'm telling you, literally once the first crisp day of fall begins, clear through winter heading into the spring.